Flying a kite. It is a bright sunny day. Peppa and her family are in the park. They are going to fly a kite. <laughs> George is going to fly the kite first. George runs as fast as he can. But the kite won't fly. George, you're doing it all wrong. You didn't run fast enough. Now it's my turn. Peppa runs as fast as she can. <laughs> but the kite still won't fly. <laughs> the kite won't fly if there isn't any wind, no matter how fast you run. Oh. We just have to wait until the wind picks up a bit. Oh. Uh. Getting windy. Now that it is windy, the kite can fly. <laughs> the wind is quite strong now. The wind is very strong now. George! <laughs> Thank you, Daddy. <laughs> Daddy Pig flies the kite. Hooray! <laughs> higher, higher. <laughs> Daddy Pig flies the kite very well. <sighs> yes, I am a bit of an expert at these things. Watch out for the trees. You might get the kite stuck in one. Don't worry. I know what I'm doing. <laughs> oh, dear. Daddy Pig has got the kite caught in a tree. Oh, no! Oh! Don't worry, George. <laughs> Daddy will get the kite down. Hooray! <laughs> uh, yes. <laughs> Careful! There's a big muddy puddle. Pepper and George love to jump in muddy puddles. Can we jump in the puddle? Please? No, I don't want you covered in mud. Oh. Stand back, children. Please be careful, Daddy Pig. I know what I'm doing. Please be careful. <laughs> Just a bit further, Daddy. <laughs> Daddy Pig, you are much too heavy for that branch. Nonsense! I know exactly how heavy I am. There. Hooray! Daddy Pig has rescued the kite. Whoa! Oh dear, everyone is covered in mud. <laughs> it's only mud. <laughs> <laughs> Luckily, Daddy Pig hasn't hurt himself. And the kite is out of the tree. Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> Mummy, now that we're all muddy, can we jump in the puddle? I suppose so. After all, you can't get any muddier. <laughs> <laughs> and I think Daddy Pig is going to be doing the washing. Oh. <laughs> Peppa and George love jumping up and down in muddy puddles. <laughs> Mummy and Daddy love jumping up and down in muddy puddles. Everyone loves jumping up and down in muddy puddles. <laughs> jumping up and down in muddy puddles is just as much fun as... My cousin Chloe. <laughs> Peppa and George are playing in the garden. To me, George! You threw the ball too hard, George. So the rules say I win. Now it's my turn. <laughs> I win again. Pepper, George, today your big cousin Chloe is coming to visit. Yippee, <laughs> cousin Chloe. George, Chloe's a big girl like me. So don't be sad if she finds you too little to play with. 
Oh, I'm sure Chloe will play with both of you. Chloe's here. Auntie Pig has brought Chloe to spend the day at Pepper's house. <laughs> Chloe is Pepper and George's cousin. <laughs> Chloe is a bit older than Pepper and George. Hello, Chloe. <laughs> Hello, Pepper. Hello, George. <laughs> See you later. Do you want to play a game? <laughs> yes, let's play catch. Peppa loves playing catch. Do you still play catch? That's a game for little children. Oh, we only play catch because George likes it. OK, let's play it for George. Do you play it with the proper rules or the baby rules? Proper rules. I'll start. <coughs> Peppa, you're it. Catch me if you can. <coughs> Peppa is it. She has to chase Chloe and George. Can't catch me. <laughs> George, I'm going to easily catch you. You're so little. <laughs> That's not fair. You're helping George. That's because he's little. Do you want me to help you? No, I don't need help. I'm a big girl like you. Come on then, Pepper. Try and catch us. <laughs> Can't catch us. <laughs> Can't catch us. <laughs> this is a silly game. Can we play something else? OK. I know a really good game for big children. It's called Sly Fox. <laughs> Sly Fox? I want to play Sly Fox. What is it? One person is the sly fox, and the others creep up on them. Me, me! I want to be the sly fox. Peppa <laughs> is the sly fox. While her back is turned, the others creep up on her. But if Peppa turns and sees someone move, they have to go back to the start. George, I saw you move. Back to the start. <laughs> Got you. I win. You moved before I was ready. The rules say I can move when I like, don't they, George? <coughs> now it's Chloe's turn to be the sly fox. Pepper and George must stay very still. <coughs> Pepper, I saw you move. Back to the start. <coughs> it's not fair. You look too long. The rules say I can look as long as I want. <coughs> Back to the start. <coughs> <coughs> George is the winner. <laughs> Can we play a different game? Yes, but as long as it's a grown-up game. I know! Let's play my favourite game. It's very grown-up. George, do you know what Peppa's favourite game is? <laughs> Peppa's favourite game is jumping up and down in muddy puddles. George, if you jump in puddles, you must wear your boots. <laughs> I've brought some boots for you too, Chloe. I'm too grown up to jump in muddy puddles. Oh, so am I. <laughs> George loves jumping in muddy puddles. Secretly, Peppa would love to jump in the puddle, but she wants to look grown up. I hear there's some puddle jumping going on. <laughs> Mummy Pig and Daddy Pig love jumping in muddy puddles. It does look fun. Yes, it does. <laughs> Maybe there's a rule that says big girls can jump in muddy puddles. Yes, that's a good rule. <laughs> Race you! Race you! Peppa and Chloe love jumping up and down in muddy puddles. Everyone loves jumping up and down in muddy puddles. Even grown-up girls. <laughs> Daddy Pig wears glasses. He needs to wear glasses to see clearly. When Daddy Pig wears his glasses, everything looks fine. But when Daddy Pig takes his glasses off, he can't see things clearly. Everything looks a bit soft and fuzzy. So it is very important that Daddy Pig knows where his glasses are. Sometimes Daddy Pig loses his glasses. Peppa, George, have you seen Daddy Pig's glasses? 
He can't find them anywhere. No, Mummy. Peppa and George do not know where Daddy Pig's glasses are. Oh, dear. Daddy Pig cannot see a thing without them and it makes him very grumpy. Without his glasses on, Daddy Pig cannot read his newspaper. This is ridiculous. I can't see anything. Somebody must have put my glasses somewhere. Do you remember where you last put them, Daddy Pig? When I don't wear them, I always put them in my pocket. But they aren't there now. Daddy, can we help find your glasses? Good idea, Pepper. If you find them, Daddy will stop being so grumpy. I'm not grumpy. <laughs> <laughs> Pepper and George are looking for Daddy's glasses. Pepper looks under the newspaper, but Daddy Pig's glasses are not there. Oh. George looks on top of the television, but Daddy Pig's glasses are not there. Oh. Let's look upstairs in Mummy and Daddy's bedroom. <laughs> <laughs> Peppa and George are looking in Mummy and Daddy Pig's bedroom. George, be careful not to knock anything over. Ah! <laughs> it's not funny. Peppa looks under the pillows, but Daddy Pig's glasses are not there. Oh. George looks in Daddy's slippers. But the glasses are not there either. <coughs> Let's look in the bathroom. <laughs> Peppa and George are looking in the bathroom. The glasses are not in the bath. Oh. The glasses are not in the toilet. Oh. <sighs> it's too difficult. Pepper and George cannot find Daddy Pig's glasses anywhere. We've looked everywhere, but we can't find Daddy's glasses. Oh dear, now what can we do? I suppose I'll just have to learn to do without them. If I move slowly, I won't bump into things. There they are! Daddy's glasses! Daddy Pig, you were sitting on them all the time. Oh. <laughs> Silly Daddy. <laughs> I don't know how they got there. <laughs> I wonder how. <laughs> <laughs> well, you may have been a bit silly, Daddy Pig, but at least you're not grumpy anymore. I was not grumpy. <laughs> <laughs> Peppa Pig Peppa Pig Peppa Pig This is my little brother George, this is Mummy Pig, and this is Daddy Pig. <laughs> Peppa Pig. Flying the kite. Peppa Pig. Peppa Pig. Peppa Pig. Brother George, this is Mummy Pig, and this is Daddy Pig. <laughs> Peppa Pig. 